Okay, welcome back to S4G. It is what it is, opinion show. Uh, it's crazy. It's crazy. Now, Ben was going to speak on 6 9 situation. Now we got Hell Rel getting jumped by goons. That's what they title them, goons, in the restaurant. Um, I'm going to speak on. I'm going to speak on 6 9 situation first, right? What's crazy to me is this. At the airport, this one took the cake with me. Already, your homies, goons, whatever you want to call them, you know what I'm saying, your riders, whatever, they already had a situation. You know what I mean? Handling the situation is just two bulls. First, it started with one bull. <clears throat> the other bull's in the wheel. Eventually, he hopped out the wheel. Um, and they're already coming at the bull, checking him or whatever. So, one of the bulls stole the bull. On some Arby Tide, just keep going back and forth with you. Now they on him. Why does the boy 6'9 come running out the airport? You know what I'm saying? I guess he see, okay, we're going to dominate these boys. You know what I mean? It's more of us than them. He, he did better to stay in the airport. Because right as soon as he runs out the airport, he runs out the airport and runs into the situation, and next minute he's on the ground. It's a very bad look for you. If anything, what I would have did was, you know what I'm saying? If I was you, I was you, because for, for real, for I'd have been already out there. You know what I mean? I'd have definitely already been out there, standing in, in, in the midst of them. But it's like, all right, let me wait, see what they're going to do. Let, let them dog them first. Then I'm going to run up in there and, and, and get a couple kicks and hits in. Definitely didn't go that way. That's crazy. They end up putting him down. Um, one of the boys. Uh, like I said, if I was in his shoes, he should have already been out there in the first place with them, or if not, step back and let them handle their business. You know what I mean? Plus, more likely, they want to, you know, keep you out of the way anyway because they want you to keep making that music and doing what you're doing. So he really messed up on that. And it made the two boys look like beasts. One of the boys screaming, I love it! We love it! I'm like, yo, what the heck? Like, give me some more. That's crazy, man. It's two boys. Two boys. Versus how many of them was it? With him? You know what I mean? It's about six, five of them. It's a very, very bad look. Very, very bad look. But again, at least nobody got shot. Nothing like that. It is what it is. <clears throat> now, Hell Rail situation, come on, man. That could happen to, to the best of them. That could happen to the best of them. It has happened to the best of them. It is what it is. You know, then on top of that, he chilling, eating with his woman. That was some real deep and personal. That was a real deep and personal situation. You know what I mean? Of all places like that, he chilling, having a. Even with his woman, they could have waited for after he came out. Anything, not you know, not condoning it, but wow, Mister Eaton with his woman. You now when you see some boys walk up to you and then a boy standing over you while you are eating, you shouldn't even let him stand over. You should have got up from the room. What's going on? What's up? Get in position, one foot in front of the other. So it is what it is, man. And then when they start going on, like I can't knock if you see because you know when the camera is showing, you never know who's behind the camera, how many dudes it really was. Could have been more than that. You know what I mean? I seen him running, taking flight. <clears throat> but at the same time, and I say, I'm sorry, I don't run, I don't run with him back. I had to, you know what I mean? We had to throw down. It ain't going like that. But then again, like I said, ain't no telling what was behind the camera. And, you know, nine times out of ten, a lot of people in situations like that, they just be trying to get out of harm's way, just get out of, you know, I guess catch him another time or however they got to do. You know what I mean? I guess the main thing be in their head, I don't want hands and feet on my face and stomping me and all that good stuff. So I'm getting out of here. I'm going to get back at him. I've seen how he look. I know who he is. But then again, it's people like, man, I'm sorry. I'm swinging through all that. We're going to rip. We're going to rip. At least somebody going to be able to say, yo, that boy hit hard, dog. Stood his ground, etc. But like I said, at the end of the day, it happens to the best of them. Not condoning it. And again, at least nobody got shot. Nobody got killed. You know what I mean? Bless to see another day. And be sharper. Be sharper with it. For now on, you see a crowd, of, uh, a couple of cats coming up to you. You know, get in position. It is what it is. Just facts. Y'all, let me know how y'all feel, man. Make the hood rich.